Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Excel. In this module, I want to talk to you about password protection, how you can stop people deleting sheets on a password protected file. So when you normally password protect something, so if I password protect this sheet, I'll just go across to format and protect it, protect sheet, I won't bother with the password, but if I click OK, I can't type specific areas like that if I highlight that I can go to format and take the padlock off these cells and then go back into format and protect that sheet all of this is okay and great I can now only type in the orange area but not anywhere else as it is at the moment nothing is stopping me from right clicking on that sheet and selecting delete and that has now deleted that sheet, even though I had it password protected. It's completely gone. Now, if you want to stop people doing that, because that is a bit of an issue, I think, you need to lock the workbook, protect the workbook, the integrity of the workbook. And to do that, you go to File, Info, and then this option. Protect Workbook. So you've got loads of options in there. One of it is this, protect workbook structure. Click on that. It's asking for a password now. I'll just give it a little password. OK. Checking I can spell. OK. So now let's see if I can delete that sheet. If I right click, that now is grayed out. I can't delete it. I can type on this sheet though. So the structure's uh, protected. I have to go format protect sheet on this sheet, which I didn't do earlier. Now is but what you should do is protect the sheets how you want them to be. And if you've got sheets where you need people to type like this one, you set that up and then you protect the structure from file info there. And that will stop anybody deleting sheets that you don't want them to do. So hopefully that little video has been of use. Thank you for your time. Catch you on the next one. Please subscribe.